Hey, what's up, Yoon fam? It is I. Black Yoon. So in today's video, we're going to take a look at the new costumes for Mortal Kombat 11 Aftermath and for the base game as well. These are the Mortal Kombat movie costume packs, so I guess now we have a few characters that can bear these costumes alongside of Shang Tsung. Uh, so we're going to go over the trailer first, and then I'm going to pause and we're going to take a look at each of these costumes and talk about them. Any ring I step into is mine. End of the line. Then this fight is now personal. It is exhausting being so perfect. So yeah, it was a pretty epic trailer for what it was, just a $5.99 costume set, and if you do look here, the costume set is available as of yesterday, and it is $5.99. It includes uh, Bridget Wilson as Sonya Blade, Christopher Lambert as Raiden, and we have uh, Lyndon Ashby as Johnny Cage. So we're going to take a look at these characters and compare them to their uh, Mortal Kombat movie counterparts. and. I think they look pretty good. Um, Bridget Wilson is a little bit, uh, I don't want to say off, but uh, I think the best one that looks like him is Christopher Lambert. Um, Johnny Cage looks the most not like his character, but they all, for the most part, they do the job. They, they look pretty close to what they would be if they were um, actually jumping right out of the silver screen. So there's nothing I have really bad to say about these characters. Uh, it's $5.99 for the costume pack. It's not included in Aftermath if you do have that or the season. Uh, not sure if I'm going to spring for this just yet, because uh, I have a backlog of stuff to play, but this is pretty exciting, it's pretty cool news, and uh, let me know in the comment section down below if you are going to purchase these and add them to your collection. Collection of the K, obviously. But with that being said, guys, I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, check back tomorrow for another vid exciting video, and as always, I love it. Thank you. Thank you.